A group of miners have been trapped underground in eastern China for two weeks now, and efforts to keep them alive have been largely successful. Bruce Harrison joins me now in the studio to tell us more. Bruce, the rescue crew outside the mine in Shandong province have drilled the seventh life hole, which is a long, narrow tunnel used to supply the miners with everything they need. That's right, Daniel. Life holes is what they're called, and so far they've been able to get the miners uh, some bottles of nutrient solution and food such as eggs as well as some other drinks. There are four miners trapped in the gypsum mine uh, which collapsed on Christmas Day. The miners are in stable condition and have laid fallen rocks on the floor of the partially collapsed room they're trapped in in order to stay dry. Rescuers will have plans to send clothes to them as well. The formation underneath is unstable and likely to be broken and collapsed. This brings great difficulties to the drilling and rescue operation. At least one miner was killed in the collapse and 13 others are missing. Around a dozen others managed to escape the mine as it fell apart. Rescue crews are currently drilling holes large enough to bring the four in contact to the surface. In 2010, 33 Chilean miners were trapped underground for 67 days. Their story of survival, also through the use of life holes, became famous, and the group landed book deals and film deals.